Sometimes I choose the Batman. I'm vengeance. Hello, we are Story Fandom. Today we were seeing Batman. Yep, the new Batman that's got the guy from Twilight. That's literally all he knows him from. It's all I know him from. Apparently, she says he's been in some decent stuff. I mean, he has some range, which I wouldn't be surprised because, as I recall from some of Kristen Stewart's earlier work, she showed a lot of range, and then she was in Twilight and. The whole joke was that she had no range. I think maybe just those movies had no range. <laughs> those movies were as bad as the books were. I'm sorry. The books were friggin' terrible. But everything was silky. I, I swear the books. to God, I wanted to strangle myself. I did do all the research. giving it a though. shot. You watched all four movies, though. They were entertaining at best, maybe. But when they come on now, I'm like, nah, I'm good. It's one of those you watch it one time and then you move on with your life. <laughs> you watch it once to know what they're talking about. You watch it once because you work at Blockbuster and you need to have an opinion. You watch it once I... because otherwise you tell people, let's watch Revolutionary Road for um, Valentine's Day. And then their girlfriend breaks up with them. <laughs> so I, when working at Blockbuster, <laughs> did not watch Twilight. Although I do remember our one co-worker... Who would not shut up about how amazing that movie was? I don't remember who that is. Victor. Oh. Oh, it was great, man. You should have... Oh, they got vampires. They're like super fat. Oh, and man, and the girl, she's so hot, man. I was like, can you just shut up? Oh, my God. <laughs> he was really, really annoying. Yeah, he was. And he could never, like, describe me to customers. No. Yeah, yeah. She's she's that, that, that white girl with the ponytail. Um she's not white. Yeah, yeah, she is. No, you're whiter than she is. <laughs> anyway. The customers were always confused because he swore up and down I was white. Hmm. But everybody knew I was Mexican. Hmm. Everybody. <laughs> Everybody and their grandmother. Anyway. So, before we get into the actual reaction itself, and you can skip past this, click, use the bar, whatever. Really quick, we are trying to get more subscribers. Subscribe so. and drive! Poop cookies. Poop cookies. Aesop's Fables by Brendy. So if you just said and said to yourself, what the frig is poop cookies? Aesop's Fables by Brandy. Subscribe. Aesop's Fables by Brandy. And when we hit 250, we will tell the story of poop cookies. Poop cookie, poop cookie, poop And we'll even tell the sequel in the same video of poop cookies. Free of charge! Free of charge! Nope. We've done this a lot of times today, guys. There were a lot of trailers that came out of the fandom, okay? I'm the last one, though, right? We are. Poop cookies. Poop anyway, the sequel is called Drop and Trowel. Aesop's Fables by Brandy. So go ahead and subscribe. Poop cookies. Talk less. Poop more. <laughs> Poop cookies. Let's go ahead and start. I'm going to pop okay. in the reaction okay. window. So this is the one. It's got Twilight Boy in it. But apparently he does good work in indie films, which I haven't seen any of. And people are raving everywhere I've seen about how awesome this preview is. So let's see if A it lives up to preview could be awesome without the actor being awesome. This is true. Because I always remember my example of that being the preview for the remake. I just got him started on something else. Why you I did. <laughs> God, I can't remember the name of it. Um, the one with the Kraken. And fuck. Hello, 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 hello. No, she doesn't know. God, Clash of the Titans. Clash of the Titans. <laughs> he did? Yeah, he whispered it to Joey. It's literally a second did before he said it. The point of it is, is <laughs> the trailer for Clash of the Titans, back when I worked at Blockbuster, used to play, you know, on that stupid <laughs> loop with the video. The trailer was awesome. He had the heavy metal drums, and then he's like, boom, yeah! And the movie sucked. It was so boring. <laughs> I like it was how I so didn't know. boring. David was like, Clyde was like, Mom knows, Mom knows. David's like, no, She doesn't know. And I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> and David's like, 
like, oh, Clash of the Titans. It's like, eh. Like, two times You don't, you never remember anything. I know. This doesn't show me up. Anyway, let's just watch the friggin' trailer. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, man. So funny. Duct tape. Told you. We knew it was duct tape. Everybody knew it was duct tape. No more lies. I'm your secret friend. Who? This guy. He's supposed to be Gord? I think so. I have no clue. Which is super weird. Let's play a game. Good job. Just me and you. I know he said that no more lies. You're becoming quite a celebrity. Why is he running to you? Oh crap, that's him. I didn't even recognize him with that hair. Really? Nice, that one. That's good. I mean, after the Riddler he's going after? I assume so. That was a very brutal video. Mm-hmm. You didn't like that part, though? I am vengeance. No. I'm sorry. No. Like, they really had me. And then he said that, and it kind of just was like... Hey. I do hey, like... Everyone... I'll still watch it, but... Do anyone want to hear my Batman first? Okay. Here it is. That was better than his. I'm Batman. I'm Batman. Okay, before you hurt your voice, you should probably take a break. (laughs) (laughs) So, I do like the fact that the Batmobile this time is clearly just a regular car. Okay. A regular car that he went ahead and um, outfitted to be the Batmobile. Because, like, I, I, I did like, you know, the Dark Knight and all, all those ones, Batman Begins. But his Batmobile was literally just a military tank <laughs> he, he borrowed from an R&D department. That Batmobile was clearly, had been a, a muscle car that he just re-outfitted to be the Batmobile. Mm-hmm. Which was nice. Mm-hmm. Not sure I feel about him being Bruce Wayne. He looks kind of... Broody. teenagey. No, he Easy. looks super dorky. Emo. Emo, there we go. That's even better than dorky. Mm-hmm. Like, he's got the hair down and, like... The clearly way too deep eye makeup. Well, that's for a while when he's probably wearing the friggin' cowl and stuff. But I'm saying, no, like, it, at the funeral... When he was in the suit, he had way too much eye makeup. <laughs> when, he, when he was in, um... When they were doing this whole scene, the funeral, when I finally realized who he... It was him. I didn't realize, because it's just... A, they didn't look like Bruce Wayne. Bruce Wayne is always like, you know, he's got his hair back. He looks super like, you know, he looks like he'd walk onto yeah, the magazine. Yeah, he's emo Bruce Wayne. 
You can walk, yeah. Because Bruce Wayne usually yeah, you walk onto the, the runway of a professional men's <laughs> monthly. <laughs> yeah, right. Emo Bruce Wayne. Emo Bruce Wayne before his way was dropped. <laughs> so his he looked <laughs> like Peter Parker from the third Spider-Man movie. <laughs> he did. <laughs> hey, Bruce Wayne, stop sucking on that venom. Man. But, I mean, I'll watch it. <laughs> yeah, we'll watch it. You guys just... are? <laughs> Even with all that brutality, really? I think she didn't hear the bones crunching. Mm. She just heard the punching. Mm. And not the crunching. Punching, not the crunching. I didn't think Batman was supposed to be that, like, he does when he loses his, his thing. As I recall. Well, so is that what we're supposed to believe is he's emo Batman because he lost Maybe his that was... Uh, maybe that was Alfred. That was... In the beginning there. Oh, maybe. That would make it more believable and interesting. Why he rebended. Let's hope that's true. I mean, let's not. Everyone likes Alfred, but yeah. No, but let's hope that it has that good of a reason. Yeah. And then, because uh, he wasn't even like that with his parents. Well, he was a kid then. We watched freaking Gotham. But then I see they had, like, Selena Kyle there again. Yeah. So. But again, like, she looked like she hasn't really been Catwoman for very long. So are we really supposed to believe that Alfred is dead? I don't know. She looked like she borrowed someone's, like, knit cat beanie and, like, freaking cut a hole in it. Unless she's the next Catwoman? <laughs> I don't know. It is right. exactly what she looked like. But, and then they made references in the earlier DCEU movies to the really early Batman. Like, you know... One which is the time our biggest problem will wind up penguins. Remember? Yeah. So. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You know what we should do at some point? Make a list. Like, rank our Batmans. Just so we know where we stand. So we know where to put him. Emo Batman. I'm not sure I can rank the Batman. Because I don't think I care enough. I mean, I like Batman. But I don't care enough about Batman to rank the live action Batman. Except that George Clooney's Batman would be like, oh my God. it has nipples. I'm not talking about the suit. And he had a back credit card. I'll give you that one. <laughs> <laughs> like that'd be the most obvious way to find out. Hey, uh, Mastercard, who is the back credit card? Oh, uh, it looks like it's billed to Bruce Wayne. <laughs> yeah, because that's how credit cards work. You can just call up the credit card company and they'll give you someone else's personal information. <laughs> well, the cops could. Why would the cops be looking for Batman? Maybe it's one of the times that Batman's been considered a rogue and they have to go hunt him down. But he wasn't in that movie. But he... It's not canon. Don't make us go there again. This will be Pokemon all over again. <laughs> Pokemon hasn't been released! I'm just saying. You're referencing reactions that we have filmed, but we have not edited and released and will not be released for some time. So the people watching this will be like, what are they talking about with Pokemon? But that'll make them coming back for more. They'll be like, waiting for the Pokemon. They'll be like, look, we're going we're gonna to subscribe and wait for Pokemon. I want to understand this reference. Julius, do you have anything you'd like to add? I don't know about it in general. He looks like mm. he could use some shampoo. <laughs> no, that's the emo look. It's on purpose. Anyway. Ring the bell. <laughs> what did you think about Catwoman? <laughs> and her beanie. Beanie? What's a beanie? It's a hat. It's a type of hat. It's a type of style. How do you think she got the cat ears on it? Is she wearing like a headband? <laughs> Maybe that's not Catwoman. Maybe that's Blake. We know the DC has a deal with rooster teeth. Okay. I'm going to throw my phone. So they're actual cat ears. <laughs> they come <call> eel. <laughs> well, your comment like comment. Even Clara cry. did not agree with you there. Even Clara. I just want to put it out there. Um, I was just saying. Okay. Like, comment, and subscribe. If ring the bell. Ring the bell. When we get to new subscribers, okay, please stop. Ah. <laughs> When we get 250 subscribers, we'll go ahead 
Wait the <laughs> Make the poopy video. We have a Twitter. We have a Facebook. Ring the bell. We do not have a Discord. Ring the bell. We don't have to subscribe Ring to bell. that. But we may be in someone bell. else's. You never know. Ring the bell. 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 We'll see you guys next time. Ring the bell. 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 Ring the bell.